Hi everyone, it's Danny. So today I'm going to be answering a question sent in by Michael Perez. And uh, he's asking if I ever had an orchid grow a leaf that was significantly smaller than the mature leaves uh, width and length. Uh, so yeah, the answer is I do have some orchids uh, that are displaying this phenomenon. I don't know why I didn't think of doing a video earlier. So okay, let me put the tablet down. Okay, now I like to show you this little orchid here. As you can see, the bottom leaf is quite large in comparison with the second leaf and uh, possibly this new leaf that is sprouting. Now this orchid, if you remember, is the Sideria japonica that came with crown rot. Now, um, there are two possible reasons why an orchid can produce uh, smaller leaves than the previous leaves. And the first one is it is stressed. Uh, by something, whether it's a problem with the roots, a health problem, whether um, conditions are not proper, or any other factor that can stress it. Now, in most cases, in most of my cases, this is what actually happened. The orchid was very, very stressed for a reason or another. Thus, um, it didn't put enough energy, or it didn't have enough energy to put into producing a large um, and uh, normal leaves, actually. So as you can see, this one is recovering. It's putting out a new root right here, but I'm expecting the following leaves to be slightly smaller than this older leaf. And uh, yeah, this is not actually the only orchid that I have with smaller leaves, so I'm going to show you another one. This Phalaenopsis went through something similar. Now when I got it, um, it looked rather weird. Some of the leaves were kind of curly, um, it was kind of jammed in her packaging. Um, I'm thinking there's also a lack of calcium there. Anyway, it went through some harsh times and as you can see, these two leaves over here are significantly smaller than the older leaves. Um, hopefully you'll be able to see it, but anyway, yeah, they are very, very small compared to the new leaves, actually, and the older leaves. Uh, now, again, this happened because the orchid was stressed um, by something, it went through a harsh time, and uh, as time went by, the leaves returned to normal. Uh, so, as you can see, they're starting to grow back to their full length. So, yeah, um, the first reason why an orchid puts out smaller leaves is because it is stressed. So, check out the roots. Um, first thing you do, check out the roots, and if everything is quite alright, check the environment, check that you didn't overwater or underwater your orchid, and uh, you know, stuff like that. Check if it's stressed. Now there is another reason why an orchid may put out um, smaller leaves, and this is light. Now the lower the light, the bigger the leaves have to be to absorb as much light as they can. If you pro provide too much of a bright light, um, the orchid will produce smaller and smaller leaves because it doesn't really need to um, produce large leaves to obtain all the light. Now you have to be careful with this so you don't actually burn your orchid, especially Phalaenopsis orchids, which as you can see, tend to burn quite fast. They don't really like super bright sun. If you can provide bright shade, that would be perfect. So yeah, this would be the second reason. I don't have any cases actually, but as far as I know, um, this could be uh, a possibility why the orchid is producing smaller leaves. But anyway, I don't think they will go to the extent of these guys, super small. So okay, hopefully I answered your question. And um, yeah, I hope you don't have problems though. So uh, yeah, be sure that your orchid is not stressed and uh, you should be fine. Okay, if you have any other questions, place them in a comment and I might answer you with a video if I um, know what to say. So okay, I'll see you next time and don't forget to subscribe if you like what you see. Bye!